one question for you guys in today's video, and that is what is the most satisfying way to play Call of Duty? And if you ask me, the answer is really simple. It's all about keeping the momentum going, rushing around, going from kill to kill, getting feeds, getting streaks, and eventually call in that tactical nuke. Or in this case, the Diatomizer Strike on Infinite Warfare. And the reason why I chose Infinite Warfare, you probably already know if you're following this channel, but if you're not, you probably think I'm crazy, why the hell am I still playing this game? I have a ton of videos on that, so go check them out. And if you do want to know why I love Infinite Warfare, click this video right here. It's my review in 2019, and I really recommend you checking it out. But in today's video, it's all about showing you the most satisfying way to play COD, and in my opinion, Infinite Warfare brings that to its potential. Because honestly, running around, rushing around, keeping up the momentum going, having a smooth experience, Infinite Warfare really brings that to the table. It might be in space, it might have jetpacks, but still, it's one of the most fast-paced, smooth games I've ever played in the franchise, and I prefer it over the newer titles. And we're gonna do that today, and I'm gonna show you how I like to play the game. And not only am I gonna drop nukes, I'm gonna do it for subscribers of the channel that wants to help to get their first The Itemizer Strike. So not only am I gonna drop nukes for you guys, I'm also gonna help out some of my subscribers, which I'm really happy about. And once again, if you do need help yourself and you still need a The Itemizer Strike on Infinite Warfare on PS4, I have a Twitter down there that you can contact, which is the easiest way to get to me. But for now, I have been sitting down grinding nukes for subs, and those nukes you will see in this video. The most satisfying way to play Call of Duty, here we go. Going in. Got How am I like? Holy, all right, saved by the armor, thank God. So yeah, as I said, one of the biggest issues with this guy's account is that he doesn't have an advanced UAV. But it's not, not a huge deal, but of course that helps a lot. Gap here. But at least he has Dead Silence, Scavenger, all of that. The only thing I'm literally missing is a, it's an advanced UAV, but it's not a huge deal, as I said. We can work UAV with it. Ready. But if people are using Ghost and they're camping, that can uh, cause some trouble. This guy's running up. Okay, we're retasking a UAV. We're alright, we're alright. We're doing okay. Oh, that was a teammate. I thought UAV both of them were enemies. Holy. I almost Friendly messed up right there. All right, all right, all right. I'm not a huge fan of how these guys are playing right now, though. They are not really moving that much. They're staying back. This guy's coming in. Oh. I think my teammate killed him. Okay. All right. A little slow. There we go. And we're using the uh, nuke variant for the Volk. He did have a few nuke variants, but... Little triple right there, beautiful. But I wanted to mix it up a little bit. The wolf is a weapon I don't use too much. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh my god, though, the armor has saved me twice right now. The thing about these enemies is that literally they're on top of each other all the time. Like, it's so freaking hard to engage. You see, they're all there together. If I push up there, I'm just gonna die. We gotta go over back. Please tell me they're not moving. That's an unplayable character. There we go. Alright, we're on a 20. 5 off. I, I don't know why, but I get a little bit more nervous when I drop news to subscribers. And especially when I don't have an advance, because they literally can pop out anywhere. Like, if anyone is using Ghost right now, that freaks me out. Oh my god, no. You mean? Are you good? Well, did he kill them? I think they got him. All right, but even though it's a little bit more nerve-wracking dropping nukes when I don't have all the things I'm used to having, it's still one of the most satisfying things to do in Call of Duty. We really have to. There we go. That's the nuke. We just got it in time. Perfect. 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 Call it in. Oh, the camper right there. All right, we got it, thank God. All right, that's David C. got the nuclear challenge on screen right now. So we got him his very first Atomizer Strike. Hopefully you're happy, man. Uh, that was fun. It's always satisfying to drop nukes, especially 
when it's the first one. And I do get a little bit more nervous. There's a few guys over here. Hold on. Can I find them? Nah. 48 and 3. Pretty good gameplay, honestly. Laravili. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that, but I hope you're happy, man. I know you've been waiting for a while, and I finally got around to drop you a nuke today. I literally sat down today to drop nukes for subscribers. That was my goal for today's video. Uh, so uh, we're just going to jump on the next account, pretty much. So there we go. Free for all. Eliminate all targets go. of opportunity. Alright, I think Free For All can do us a little bit better. And I love the fact that this guy's Master Prestige. 30. So I can actually use the Oza. The Oza is a gun that I haven't used in a very long time. And it's fun that I can drop nukes with it. I like that. So we're now on Blackjack Blaze. This account. We're still going. We have played two TDM matches, and I thought, let's jump over to free for all. Because I feel like I can dominate free for all, and I want to mix it up a little bit. Yo, man, this weapon is a beast, though. If you control the recoil, the recoil is a pain in the ass. Here we go. Very nice. there when the recoil goes a little bit crazy and I get shot and I flinch Ooh, you can uh, can lose a lot of shots oh my god once again you see like it's crazy this gun is good don't get me wrong but uh he can screw you over oh Yeah, the recoil is crazy, bro. Alright, maybe not the best choice of a weapon. We're gonna try. Keep going. Where they at? I, hear, I can hear somebody over here. Yo, at least this guy has an advance. Which makes it a lot easier. Oh, crap. Yeah, I think we got this one. I think this is the lobby, ladies and gentlemen. I think we're going to drop the nuke right here. I don't like to say that because I might choke, but we need some confidence, man. For some reason, I'm way more nervous now than usual. Because I'm not on my own account. I want to make these people happy, and I do got a few nukes to go through. So, the faster I can get them, the better. But I have a good feeling. I have a good feeling. Alright. Not too far off my next advance. Go five off. I actually don't think, yeah. We're actually not going to be able to get an advance. But we got the camel. That's nice. That's nice. There's a guy camping in a corner here. Here we go. I don't know if he was playing. I think he was. He was just camping. Alright, if I can get three more kills, I can at least assure my final kill with the camo. I don't want to try. I want to try to not use the camo just to use it. There we go. Okay, one more. Come on, come on, come on. Give me one more kill and I got this. There we go. Okay, 100%. We got this nuke right now. We're just gonna use the camo. And we're gonna go for a kill. Come here, come here, come here, come here. No, 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 no. No. There we go. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Free for the way, Bray, baby. What the hell was I trying to say right there? That was a combination of bro and baby, which turned into Bravey. So, uh. Whoa! I got melted. But that's fine. We got the nuke. Uh. There we go. There we go. Baby and bros. The recoil. Come here, bro. Alright. Uh, okay, we're not going to kill anymore because we want this nuke to go off. Boom, Blackjack. There is your first Yadamizer Strike in Infinite Warfare. Thank you for allowing me to jump on your account and drop you a nuke. There's nothing like dropping that very first DA to see that challenge popping up. Absolutely love it. And it's a throwback for me as well, going back to that feeling of actually getting the first nuke. So, we do still have one more person to go for our nuke though, so we're going to jump on his account and uh, see what we can do. So let's uh, keep going. Free for all. You're on your own, soldier. 19, yeah, there's no way. Enemy UAV. The enemy has a drone package. 
This nuke would have been so much easier if I had an advance, if I had dead silence. Like I don't have anything. Literally. On this class. The enemy launcher counter UAV. Serious? Let's get over here, man. 22 kills. That is the way. Might be a good lobby, though, so we're gonna stick around. What am I doing, bro? Kimbo shotguns? Yeah, maybe this lobby. It's not worth. Did you see how slow my rewind actually reacted right there? Holy shit, man. This game don't want me to drop a nuke. I'm not gonna lie. We're a little bit lucky right there. Look, will I get out of here? I've been playing on this account now for over an hour. It's really been tough. Not only because I don't have an advanced UAV on standby. or dead silence and stuff that I actually really like, and he like barely has any nuke variants. It's the FHR, the ERAD, and the the fallout. That's literally the only new variance. And I don't want to use the fallout. I've, I've used that a lot. No, there's no way we're going to drop the new in this game, actually. I'm not going to give up, but... We actually have to focus up. I don't know what I was talking about either. Let's just focus on the game. The enemy has a drone package. Come on, FHR. Come on, baby. I need these people to come around me. He has five kills for three wins. Oh, this guy right here. Man, not having dead silence is such a disadvantage. Bro. And I'm starting to get pissed off. I want this dude so badly right now. Oh, come on. Kimbo shot. You have no idea how many shotguns I've been killed from today. It's getting so annoying. Come on, Pejas. Not even a shotgun is going to stop you right now. No claws, no nades, nothing. You've been choking too much. Get the hell out of here. He had a shot. Did you see that, man? The time is running out? Oh my god. I need five kills in 25 seconds. Right now. Look at this camper, bro. I'm actually getting three more kills. Come on, come on, come on! Oh my god, there's no way. Two more, two more! Ten seconds! Bro, where are they at? One more. No! She said the itemized strike. I got it. I actually got it. The, the final kill there was the 25, but it was when the game was over. I think I got it. Did I get it? Did, did that count? It actually did. Holy shit. I actually... I wasn't quite sure, but it actually, I actually pulled that off. That final clutch kill right there. Oh my, I'm so happy that I'm done. I was getting really frustrated over this account because like I didn't have an advance. I didn't have that silence, which I use all the time. And when the lobbies like recently just have been shotguns and I had bad connection, uh, it's just, and I haven't been playing that well either because I didn't have too many new grants to choose from and I refused to use the NB4. So it's been th that final nuke right there, that clutch nuke was a great freaking way to end this video. Uh, if you by any chance still need a Deitomize to Strike on Infinite Warfare on PlayStation 4, you can hit me up on Twitter, but I will wait a little bit now because I don't want to keep doing this all the time. I want to mix up my contents. I want to focus on other projects. But today was all about dropping nukes. And as you guys said, uh, as I said, I asked you guys on Twitter and I dropped a nuke to everybody who responded 
within those hours I asked until I started playing today. So I hope you guys are happy, the ones of you that I got to help today. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Drop a subscription if you did enjoy. Like the video if you did enjoy it as well. And hit notifications if you always want to know what goes on on the channel. As I said, if you do want to help with the Itemizer Strike, hit me up on Twitter. It's down in the description. And I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. But as of right now, I will focus a little bit on other types of videos. But I will, of course, keep helping you out as well if you still want to. That's it. Thank you for watching. I gotta stop talking. Have a great weekend, guys. Goodbye.